Today, 19th of July, is danger day. Well, danger day basically means it's a good day for us to do hunting, do sales. Basically, it's a good day for us to make money. So, having this opportunity, this kind of energy will bring you abundance amount of energy force to launch something because there are a lot of auspicious stars, especially when it comes to wealth stars. So, take the opportunity and advantage of all these positive stars to launch your attack, launch your sales, launch your promotions, launch your campaign, anything which drives sales. Or perhaps you may launch your debt collections program today. So it's all about sales hunting, getting all the invoice paid. You know, this is the good activities, which is resonance with today because you have the golden lock, what we call the uh, auspicious wealth lock. So basically it's like, you know, you're going to collect all the money, you lock it down in your golden lock, your golden chest. And this is very important for us to save capital, especially when we are planning to the upcoming period nine, we will need a lot of resources to invest into new inventions. So hopefully this is a good day for you to launch all your debt collection, financial activities, and perhaps it's good for you to do a lot of, uh, uh, project signing agreement because there's a lot of pos uh, positive stars. The only thing which is not recommended is to do praying or worshipping because yeah, the star is not supporting that aspect. So anyway, so it's all about go out to get what you want. So after all the preparations, it's all about going out to take all the opportunity to grab the opportunity. And today's hexagram is abundance hexagram well abundance hexagram brings this massive abundance amount of opportunity but right now you can see the storm is brewing uh the thunder cloud is forming but once the thunder cloud is start to form it will unleash heavy amount of rain a lot of resources to support you know the the growth of the farmland of all this plantation so you just need to prepare. Right now, it's not yet happened. You need to wait for the right time. And with the changing line four, basically it means that the you need someone to support you, especially when you're feeling something, you're not uh, sufficient, you feel you need some backup, you need a lot of advice. Somehow you just feel like, you know, you're lacking of something that you need someone to compliment and be willing to go out to find this person, hunt for this person, to get them as your consultant, your advisor, your counselor, your counts, uh, your counselor, you know, they were able to help you to fine tune and be more precise in helping you make better decisions in during this kind of process in making more abundance or collecting abundance amount of money. So overall, today is a very good day for you to collect money, do sales, promotion, launching, anything. It's all about sales, guys, okay? So do check out my next video for today's divine message. Okay, and if you are ready, so close your eyes, just think of your divine message. There'll be three cards, card A, card B, card C. Select either one, okay? I will pick a card and all you need to do to pick your own card and I will do the reading, okay? So if you're ready for card A. Your card is arriving arriving hexagram basically means that all the stuff that you have planned all the stuff that you've already allocated you just need to go out to do the hunting you just need to execute your plan is already uh, well designed you just need to wait for the right time right now all the suspense all the process it feels so so much exhilarating and a lot of excitement at the same time so this hexagram basically means that Whatever you plan, whatever the stuff that you wish to attain, it will come very soon. But the problem is, don't forget to enjoy the current moment because sometimes we are too eager to wait for the result. Sometimes you are more exciting when we are waiting for the, let's say we order something online, you, are, you receive a lot of notifications, a lot of signal that, oh, your package is arriving soon. So this is what is telling you that stop worrying about the future focus on the process because things will arrive will come to you very soon but your mindset if you if your energy are operating at a low frequency means you are downward spiral you are not happy you are depressed and you have a lot of comparison all this negative emotional it may affect the final outcome or may de delay the, the 
the durations of how long it will come to you. So make sure you keep your, your spirit high on happy frequency, you know, higher spirit, higher uplifting, motivated, uh, kind of pump up uh, feeling that is important because frequency will affect the overall outcome. So as long as you position yourself on a higher frequency, this will easily manifest and attract more positive abundance of opportunity. Okay. So let's talk about card B. Card B is the heaven hexagram. Well, the heaven hexagram basically means this is the power of creations and everything are in so timely that you need to execute your creative plan. So you can't delay anymore. It's just you have to get every single layer of the preparations, launching, contact list, every, every single thing from A to Z, you have to get every checklist pumped up, get it filled up. It's all about going out to bring your idea to unleash it in this very moment, okay? And last, for those who have selected card C, well, this is your hexagram. Biting. Well, biting basically means that there could be potential of disagreement, argument because you may have said something wrong. Because right now is not the time for debate. It's not the time for you to argue, to fight who is right, who is wrong. It's all about making progress, motivating, motivating each other to, you know, keep everyone moving forward to create results. Stop pondering about the back, what happened in the past does no longer help you. Sometimes whatever coming out from your mouth could influence a lot of people and they would feel they care about whatever you say. So don't think of, ah, I'm just bluffing. No, every single word coming out from your mouth does in, impact and influence the masses a lot. So you have to keep yourself self-composed, not overly say too much unnecessary, focus more on biting through the entire process you don't need to say anything right now which is negative focus on the positive keywords to empower to encharge everyone to move forward towards the goal that you all desire once you reach your destinations your, your final goal you get the final outcome then during the revision or the review session only then you sound out your opinion you release all your dissatisfaction and find way to resolve it, to improve it in the next project. But right now, this is a crucial time for you to pack up all the positive energy, the motivations to bring everyone to reach to the goal first before you get them burned out before you even reach your final destination. Okay, so that's all from me, Jonathan Lee from Renergy. If you are seeking for a more personalized consultation, please do go to my website to check out more information and book a session with me and I'll help you to discover your personality, your spiritual guidance, how to unleash your subconscious and of course your team of life.